So without further ado, uh, let's get going. The way I'm going to do this is I'm going to go through the honorable mentions first. So these are the people who have made it through the first selection process. Um, I, I'm, I'm going to basically try to write the title, try to read the title of the paper. And because of time, I'm only going to mention the first author and, uh, and uh, maybe uh, the, the affiliation of the first author. I see some of you are smiling because last year I've made a little bit of a fool myself trying to uh, pronounce all these uh, biology and chemistry stuff. I'm a computer scientist, so please bear with me. And in the spirit of participating, feel free to shout and tell me how to pronounce things. I did come prepared this time. I have some, uh, some things here. So, so <laughs> thanks, Ermesa, indeed. So let's get going. This is biological sciences. We're going to start with the honorable mentions. This is in no particular order, by the way. Uh, uh, the paper is called Purification, Characterization, and Antibacterial Activity of L-Amino Acid Oxidase from Serostates. Uh, this is a paper by, by uh, Ziad uh, Mizian Hanan Fadila from Beb Zawar, USCHB. Well done to them. <laughs> Quercetin mitigates adriamycin adriamycin induced anxiety and depression like behaviors, immune dysfunction, and brain oxidative stress in rats. First author, Siham Merzoug, from the University of Baji Mukhtar in Annaba. <laughs> this uh, group was actually the winner in last year's biology uh, category. <clears throat> Immu immunomodulatory and protective properties of tacrolimus. Oh. Where am I? There you go. Pull myself again. Ah, there it is. Uh -huh. New complexes of mag um, manganese 2, nickel 2, and copper 2 with derived benzoxaz benzoxazole ligand synthesis characterization, DFT, antimicrobial activity, acute and subacute toxicity. Afaf Bushusha from also USDHP. <laughs> Iron exchange. Membrane textile, bioreactor as a new alternative for drinking water denitrification. First author, Delila Bodros, also from Bebzua. Well done to them. <laughs> and then we come to the paper I started with. Immunomodulatory and productive properties of uh, tacrolimus in experimental scorpion envenomation. Uh, first author, M. Cabrin, also from Bebzua. Well done to them. So there's a, a lot coming from Beb Zawar that have made it in the, as honorable mentions. Um, we're going to have a special guest to make the announcement uh, for uh, biological sciences. This is Dr. Abbas Abdel Noor. Um, he's an assistant professor in the Department of Bioproduct and Biosystems Engineering in Minnesota University in the United States. Uh, he leads the Biosensors and Bionanotechnology Research Lab. <laughs> and he was previously at Washington University and, and University of California. Um, he received an honorable mention in the MIT 35 under 35 um, uh, awards. And he's been making quite a lot of buzz recently on the internet because of this achievement. We're extremely honored to have him with us. Uh, he couldn't be with us live, but he sent us this video this morning to make the announcements. So I'll leave it up to him to do that. Good afternoon, everyone. First of all, thank you for uh, allowing me to be with you today. Uh, I reviewed a few papers last year, and today I'm reading one of the winning papers this year. And frankly, I'm impressed by the quality and level of research uh, done in Algeria with really minimum resources. So I'm very proud today to announce one of the winning papers. The winner of the best Algerian paper award in the category of biological sciences is entitled Silver Nanoparticles in Combination with Acetic Acid and Zinc Oxide Quantum Dots for Antimicrobial or Antibacterial Activities Improvement, a comparative study. The paper was published last year in Applied Surface Science and is authored by Sofiane Sidera, Ahmed Abdel Hakim, Ayashi, Siham Lekhal, Marwan Fatah, and Sliman Ashour. Uh, from uh, Ceramic Lab, 
and the microbiological lab engineering and application, both from Jamia uh, Tqsantina. Congratulations, guys. Uh, the paper deals with the use of nanotechnology uh, for uh, biological application. Uh, silver nanoparticles, uh, uh, those tiny silver particles, are known to have microbial, uh, antimicrobial activities, uh, which means if you put silver particle with a bacteria, the bacteria will die. And Sofian and his collaborators found a very simple way uh, to improve the performance of those uh, silver particles. And this is important uh, because it can have applications in the use of uh, antimicrobial surfaces in hospitals or clinics, for example. Again, uh, congratulations for uh, Sofian and his collaborators and to all the winning uh, papers this year. Uh, and thank you very much, guys, for uh, organizing this. Uh, I really appreciate what you do. Thank you very much, and have a good evening. Goodbye. Uh, we're extremely grateful to the North for taking the time to announce the winner of the biology uh, category. Congratulations to them, indeed. Hello, Assalamu alaikum, Mr. Sofia. السلام عليكم مرحبا بك راكم معنا على البث المباشر تاع احسن منشور علمي في البايولوجيكال ساينسز الف الف مبروك على النجاح تاعك الله يبارك فيك مالك لو تعطينا الانطباعات تاعك وشي واش شعور الفوز تاعك والله اني فرحان جدا هذا الصوت مع مع حبيبي نتابع الحفظ واحد المباشر هناك قطاعات من الحين الاخر ما ادري ماذا هو السبب كنا ان شاء الله نكون مفيد ان شاء الله الباحثين ان شاء الله ان شاء الله بارك الله فيك يعطيك الصحه ونبقى معنا في البث المباشر ان شاء الله